It is the 21st of September 2012 and in this video I'll be unboxing the brand new white iPhone 5. Alright guys, so this just got here. This is a white 16 gigabyte iPhone 5. Uh, I actually ordered these as soon as um, the Apple Store went back online. So uh, that's why I'm getting mine on launch day. If you order it now, I believe there's a three to four week wait. So there it is right up front. We'll go ahead and set that packaging off to the side. Taking a look at the box, we see the white iPhone up front. Uh, and uh, you can see the four inch retina display. On the side, iPhone 5, bottom Apple logo, iPhone 5, Apple logo. Then on the back, we see 16 gigabyte. Uh, what's in the box and uh, yeah so without further ado let's get right into this new iPhone 5 we'll go ahead and slice the packaging time for the grand reveal let's go ahead and tear off all that plastic and we'll go ahead and lift up the box and see the iPhone 5. Very tight fit, as usual with Apple. Definitely got a bit of heft. And there is the iPhone 5 itself. There's no foam padding in the top of the box. Apple seems to be cheaping out on the packaging these days. And wow, does that look nice. Up front, we can see the 4-inch display. And uh, the nice white pearl color. And uh, yeah, and it feels extremely, extremely light. There we can see the silent toggle, the volume up and down. Up top, we can just see the power button uh, as the headphone jack's actually been moved to the bottom. And uh, as you can see, the new connector and uh, the headphone jack. And of course, up front, we've got that front-facing camera. That's just some sensor uh, for when you put it up to your face, it knows to turn off the screen. And on the back, we can see that gorgeous new design with white glass on the top and bottom and silver in the middle. And there is our eight megapixel camera and our LED flash. We'll go ahead and set the iPhone off to the side for just one moment. Have a look at our documentation. Designed by Apple in California, as always. Go ahead and slide that open. There's our SIM eject tool for popping out the tray to put in the SIM card. And um, a thing of note, these iPhones take nano SIMs, not micro SIMs like the iPhone 4S. So uh, you probably have to get in touch with like your carrier so they can send you out a nano SIM. So here we have Hello, going through some of the features of the new iPhone 5, and of course, what we all came here for, the Apple stickers. Go ahead and set that aside. Here are these uh, talked about ear pods. These are meant to be really, really nice. And uh, I'll have a full review of these coming up on the channel later on. Here we have the power adapter. And finally, the lightning, because I keep in mind this isn't the 30 pin dot connector anymore. They've got a new port the lightning to USB connector. Up close, you can see just how small that connector is. So uh, if you're traveling, this will certainly be an advantage. So let's push all this aside and we'll give you a first boot of the iPhone 5. Let's go ahead and peel off all that plastic and uh, we'll go ahead and turn it on. And seriously, it does feel extremely light compared to the 4S, even though we do get a nice big four inch display. And uh, Apple claim you can still use this one-handed uh, really easy. And um, yeah, you certainly can. Like I can touch up in the top right corner, top left corner, all fairly easily. Because I'm actually used to a Samsung Galaxy Nexus, which has a 4.65 inch display. So I'm used to the big screens. Here we can see iPhone. Go ahead and slide across. Yes, we'll use English. Yes, I have not got a SIM card in at the moment. 
We'll select British English next. Setting language. And the screen really does look gorgeous. So I think I need a SIM card uh, to get to the home screen, even though this is an unlocked iPhone, so I find that kind of odd. But yeah, I guess that's going to do it for the unboxing, guys. I'll figure out a uh, nano SIM, and uh, hopefully I'll be able to get to the home screen of the iPhone. So stay tuned for plenty more videos on the iPhone 5, and of course the new iPods next month. Drop a comment down below, are you getting an iPhone 5? Click that subscribe button right above this video, and follow me on Twitter over at twitter.com slash iTechEverything. This is uh, odd that I can't just get to the home screen without a SIM card. If you have any tips on how to do that, drop a comment down below, and I'll see you guys next time.